if you have a dominant horse, if it's a stallion, a uh, young stallion, or maybe uh, just um, castrated gelding, um, it's very important to have a certain body language that is showing that you are the leader. It's very important to keep this leadership. It's very important to be always straight and uh, to be always fair with your horse. Stallions, uh, dominant horses, and especially stallions, they, um, they have a very good sense for what is um, correct, correct or what is not correct, um, to, uh, or fairness. So if I work with a horse and I want to do something with him and he's getting naughty and he's biting me and I slap him and I slap him too late or slap like not only one time, two, three times, he feel that that's mean, he feel that that's not fair and he might be more aggressive. So it's, it's very, very tiny the way you can go with the horse to have a good communication, to have the respect from you to the horse and the horse to you, and to be always fair in your actions and to be very consequent, very uh, straight in what you want from your horse. Um, it's the most important thing in work with stallions and with dominant horses. Many people who have uh, stallions want to uh, and want to work free and want to play with them in freedom. Um, I need to say that it's risky. You can do it with a stallion, but you have uh, you have to have a really clear communication with your stallion, and the stallion needs to really accept you as a team leader or as a, as, as the leader. Um, it's risky with stallions if you start playing with them and you and you lose a bit the sense of. Um, of who is the leader or what is happening with your horse, it can be sometimes dangerous because uh, it's really a tiny path from uh, playing to aggressive or uh, aggressive uh, aggression with uh, stallions. And especially if you get in a nervous atmosphere, if you uh, the people are making pictures of you, you doing a photo shoot or something and you're a little bit more nervous than normal, you're in a different place and you're asking your horse 10 times the same thing, then it might be again an unfair situation and it might be like that, that the horse gets more aggressive than usual. So be careful with stallions, be careful playing with, sense with stallions. It's possible, but don't lose the sense and don't be unfair. You really have to know what you're doing.